right now. All systems go. The atmosphere is incredible. Loving it. The atmosphere in there is just A1 at the moment. And it's just the start of it too. You can see how many people are here tonight. It just shows how this music's still current. Ten years on. If you've ever met Tony DeVille or even heard him play at all, he's one of those people who, uh, once you've heard him, you were hooked. It's in probably 1987, uh, when he used to DJ at the Nightingale. Um, and he actually got me my first residency there back in 1990. He's sort of just a big influence on me all through my career, really. It still sound amazing. I mean, I already still makes the hairs on my arms stand on end after, what, 10 years old it is now? This has been one hell of a night. It really has got the feel of trade from when I remember it, and I'm talking early days. I used to drive Anthony literally all over the country. Um, so we call him Anthony. We call him Anthony, yeah. So we used to drive really all Friday night, Saturday night, etc. And the crowds that he used to draw was unbelievable. And you know, um, they used to absolutely go wild. You know, when they was uh, when he played the right tunes, absolutely fantastic. never ceased to amaze the crowds. He always had something extra when everyone thought everything had been done. And, you know, that's the best thing for me. You know, there's too many DJs out there who have all got inflated egos. And he was a real humble person, and that's why he was so special. Yeah, it's really sincere and really sweet. His music lives on. I think after 10 years I didn't think it'd be um, like this really. I thought people might have forgotten but it is lovely, it's really nice. I actually retired from clubbing three years ago but um, with Ian playing and Karim and Andy, who, you know, I had to come, definitely. It was worth coming out of retirement for, yeah. Here it comes. Totally unaffected by his by his fame and his success. Always had time for people. His music's amazing. I think it's inspirational actually. The tunes that they're playing tonight, based on Tony DeVee, are bringing back floods of memories um, from the time that I used to be to, uh, involved in trade, um, from 1994 onwards. Um, just memories, I'm showing my age now. <laughs> it's rather mental actually, really, isn't it? You know what I mean? I didn't realise Tony knew so many people. <laughs> you know what I mean? Bingo on a Sunday night. And everything. 45 quid of one and that. I knew him very, very well, so it's all a bit ridiculously emotional for me, and I probably take it too seriously, but you know. He made a complete dent in my whole life, you know. he almost created my creativity really so yeah it's pretty special actually well I just think it's brilliant that 10 years has been remembered and how the hell did 10 years happen you know? it's bringing back happy memories for me Um, the lasers are fabulous in there and it's great atmosphere, lovely people. 
Andy Farley's sale was awesome. Just absolutely awesome. I'm a, I thought I was orgasming four or five times through the set. Yeah, absolutely brilliant. You cannot fault this evening at all. Yeah, I try and play like one or two of um, the more well-known ones, but then I always try and like drop in some of the lesser-known ones as well, because people haven't heard them. I mean, I wanted to play so many tonight, but it just wasn't enough time, really. Andy Farley. You know, it's, you know, it's like Tony Devine in the flesh, really. You know, he's like... He, he's, he is Tony to be without Tony being it. He plays what he likes. Kareem's a little bit harder, he plays a bit hard, but we're still waiting for Ian M. And Tony David, I started going to trade in 91. Tony David was a raver, was a punter. I remember, I remember bumping into him in the club. I used to go to trade every weekend. He was just like a raver, really. Um, a year later, he was behind the decks and he did an amazing set. I went fucking out, man. I didn't realize he was DJ. He was, he was just perfect. It's excelled in all the expectations, the crowds are in. People are having a wonderful time. The garden areas are packed. It's just been a really, really good boy and evening. Oh, he'd be very proud. I'm sure he's looking down, rocking away. Fantastic. Yeah, it's been a real trip down memory lane. Having a wonderful sweaty time, it's been great. It's amazing, you see people from 10 years ago, you're like, oh my God, I forgot you existed. Oh, loads of memory, Dawn, everything, it's absolutely fantastic. Tonight is absolutely phenomenal. And that's why I get it marked on my neck because I just love clubbing, love coming out, love partying, and that's it. Oh, I'm having a really, really good time. I can see all the old faces, the music is really good. I miss Stoney, I miss Stale Mills, I miss the crowd. I miss the atmosphere, um, it was a big part of my life. You know, it was something that was worth coming out to. At the moment, there's nothing apart from this tonight. And the music? Oh, it's fucking amazing. It's been absolutely fantastic. The vibe is just brilliant, absolutely brilliant. It's a really amazing party. Everybody's loving it. I haven't heard a bad word yet. It's amazing. It's just what I've always wanted. It's what we've all been asking for. I'm so pleased with Paul. I'm so pleased that it's all come together. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. I think it's more than all any of us expected. Trade is dead. Long live hooked. <laughs> 